I really cannot believe I actually sat myself through this game. This game is bad. This game is really bad. Welcome to the world of Umbrella Corps, the worst Resident Evil game I have ever played. This makes Operation Raccoon City look like Fallout New Vegas. This is a terrible, terrible game. I don't know how it's set in the Resident Evil universe. Most importantly, it doesn't even have uh, the Resident Evil prefix on it. I mean, I'm not even joking. There is no Resident Evil prefix for this game. It takes place in the Resident Evil world, but I guess they don't want people finding this on Google by Googling Resident Evil. Now, I should have saw the signs of this game being absolutely terrible within the first, like, 20 minutes, because in what Resident Evil game do you run around killing zombies to dubstep music? <laughs> Now, if you'd excuse my panic grenade, that was literally unedited. That that was unedited footage. That music was actually in the background. I'm, I'm not kidding. I didn't have to do anything. I just placed the video in, and there you go. That's, that's in this game. And that death you saw there is what happens 99.5% of the time in the quote-unquote single-player campaign. What you do is you run out of ammo, you take out your stupid little ice axe, you start picking at the zombies, and because they're so poorly coded and overpowered, they just start swiping at you. One, two, three, you're dead. Easily the worst thing about this game that you can tell within like the first 30 minutes of the game is this game does not know whatsoever what kind of game it wants to be. It doesn't know if it wants to be a shoot 'em up third person, a survival horror third person. It does not know. It just has a bunch of elements kind of thrown in there into the pot and it's like, okay, go and play it. Honestly, the best example of how loosely put together this game is comes at about three-fourths through the campaign, where you get to the village from Resident Evil 4 where the Ganados are, that's the name of the enemies from RE4. If you guys haven't played Resident Evil 4, I'll explain it anyways and show you gameplay. But when you get there, it is absolutely the most laughable type of recreation I have ever seen of any video game, and especially Resident Evil 4, a game that has been re-released more times than I can count on my fingers and toes. Like, Resident Evil 4, to a lot of people, was basically perfect. So imagine the look on my face when it went from Resident Evil 4 to what I saw in Umbrella Core in the village. The only part of the game I was actually excited to look at. You know what? Honestly, I'm just going to let you guys look at it yourselves. I'm going to do Resident Evil 4 versus Umbrella Core real quick, and then we'll come right back. This is hysterical. If that didn't get the point across, then I don't know what will, or I'm just nitpicky as shit. The one thing I do have to say though, is the game gets ridiculously hard once you get to about the village part of the game. It is ridiculous. They chase you down, they will kill you, you will die in a million and one bullshit ways. These villagers are not to fuck with. I will tell you that right now, if there's one thing, this is a hard part of the game, and in my opinion, very frustrating and stupid. Hey hombres, you're not where you belong. Welcome to the village, aka hell. And 
that was the end of the road for Umbrella Core with me. That is where I ended it. That's where I pretty much gave up on the game. I went out of the menus, tried to find a multiplayer game, but of course, nobody's playing this game. It's a dollar and still couldn't revive its entire community. So that should give you a hint there. But anyways, the Humble Bundle is out right now for $12. You can get lots of really good games if you spend $12 on this Humble Bundle, as well as giving money to charity. You get Resident Evil 0 HD, Resident Evil 1 HD, you get Resident Evil 6. You get a bunch of great goodies in this month's Humble Bundle, so you should definitely check it out. Anyways, guys, my name is Nick. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already and all that cool stuff, and I'll see you guys all later. And remember, don't play this game. I'm not joking.